Welcome to the land of Nero, a world of enchanted beings. I am Pyrus, second timekeeper, son of the first. To restore peace to the chaotic land, my father, the timekeeper of old, came to watch over the land and guard the heart of Nero. This clock represents time, a responsibility no other can carry. Now, this responsibility is mine. A tragic story, a filial, familial love, and mania, obsessive love, prompts the realization of acceptance of the past. These lovely ladies. I'm old and obsolete, and centuries weigh heavily on my shoulder. You will become a next timekeeper in due time. So learn to respect others, including these fair ladies. Peasants like them don't deserve our concern. Could I have possibly raised a son with no soul? The witch's daughter. Aglaya, she left everything for you, and you loved her once. Remember, Father? I never loved Aglaya. She was only a broken toy, like all the others. Enough! This mess of fun in Paris. <laughs> Love, compassion, and you mortal seeking to serve me? This mess of party. I've been searching everywhere for you, my love. What have you been doing? Don't you want to spend more time with me? Leave me be, Yakaya. You are the reason why Father is disappointed in me. But Pyrus, it doesn't matter to me. Oh. You are perfect. Have you listened to the words coming out of your mouth? You're obsessed, darling. You used to tell me that I would be the only girl for you, the only person you would love for eternity. Aglaya, you silly thing. I was younger and naive, but I know I would never condescend to love you now. Leave. How could you be so heartless? I've left against my mother's wishes to be with you. Left my home, come to this foreign place in the north. <laughs> Don't listen to that witch, I'm calm, mother. How dare you, Paris? I love you so much. All I ask is that you love me back. Fuck. Since your disappearance with 
potion is ready. Once consumed, this potion shall give me the true vision to see into the fate I set. My heart, it hurts. This agony, I get bad. Aglaya, is that you? I am Aglaya's ghost. My poor daughter, tell me what happened. Mother, my time with you is very brief. You've always warned me about love. But, but I still love Pyrus and death. The no. pain I have suffered from a shattered no. heart is unbearable. No. Aglaia, no. I've told you countless times that Pyrus is no fit for you. He is a spoiled young man. Cruel and reckless. No. Stop saying that. Wait, my daughter, tell me what happened. I'll always be by your side, mother. Go back to the night of the masquerade. You shall see for yourself. Wait, Aglaia! <gasps> Who killed you? <gasps> <gasps> Yes, 
Does the hat on the bed? I promised you that night that I would always be yours. I just want you to love me. Don't touch me! What have I done? Your mother, the witch, she'll come avenge for her daughter's death. I'm too late. My hand! I shall force upon you all of my wrath! Father! 
If only I had learned to appreciate my father's love, such a story would have never been